just talked about Nate and this. What have you seen from Eli kind of pushing to that spot and just how he progressed so far? Yeah, I mean, Eli's a great competitor. That whole quarterback room is filled with competitors. So um, I think it starts with Nate being, you know, that leader and Eli um, being a competitor. So them just pushing each other. Uh, they've, they've done a great job, and Eli's, Eli's been doing a really good job making plays out there, leading the twos, and doing the most with all of his reps that he can. What's it been like uh, playing for Coach Brunowski and Coach Bell? We, we hear a lot about their energy. Like, how is it actually on the field? <laughs> Uh, at times, a little bit crazy. I mean, they're flying around, they're running around, um, they're electric. Um, I know there's a lot of adjectives to describe them, uh, but they're you know they're good people and they're pushing us every single day to be the best. And at the end of the day, they just want to win. And um, if it starts with the coaches just wanting to win, it's going to come down into us as well. And we just want to win. So us just being able to learn from those guys and um, feed off each other's energy, it's been a really good change for this offense. Now that you've been in uh, Coach Bell's offense for a little bit. Is there anything about it that surprised you at all? Um, nothing that's really surprised me. Uh, I mean, I guess the biggest thing that surprised me is everything that they said, you know, coming in from the very start um, has, has been true. You know, they want to go fast. They want to score points. Um, they want to push the vertical game, but then they also want to come back and run the ball down, their, down the defense's throat. And I think we've been doing that. We've been pretty balanced. Um, and I think that's coming with just being able to learn the playbook better, get more comfortable with the offense. And you can see us starting to operate a little bit, which is pretty cool to see. You guys, like, do you, uh, Gavin, will you be on the field together or two tight end sets? Or is it kind of like more you guys are kind of rotating? Yeah, our offense is, is based mainly out of 11 personnel. But um, we do have the ability to get into to, you know multiple tight end sets. So. Um, that's something that we're excited about. We're pretty multiple just as an offense in general. A um, lot of different you know, formations and personnel, so it, it stresses the defenses, defenses out a lot. So I think that's something that we could use to our advantage. How did you choose Pitt? Say that one more time. How did you choose Pitt? How did I choose Pitt? Um, yeah, I mean, I came here from the West Coast, um, and it was just almost a little bit of a culture shock. And it was just a point in my life where I needed something new. So uh, Pitt gave me that opportunity, and I'm just forever grateful for it. But I mean, the city um, kind of speaks for itself. The opportunities that the university um, can give me after football, and then as well as obviously, you know, right here and right now, uh, playing in the ACC is something that is something that you know all kids dream about. So it's it's a really cool opportunity. Yeah, I mean, obviously, I wasn't in the offense last year, um, but we are being asked to do a lot. But we love that, you know. I mean, tight ends, we pride ourselves on being able to to be able to do multiple things, whether it's in the pass game or the run game, um, whether we're motioning, whether we're pressing the field and you know down vertical or we're blocking a you know nine technique at the end. Um, so yeah, we're being asked to do a lot, but I think we're handling it really well. Uh, and that starts with, you know, Coach Bro um, just being able to teach us every single day in that meeting room. Uh, he's getting us better in there. And we hear a lot about this offense and how explosive it can be. I mean, what, what have you seen from the guys that played in it last year, the guys from Western Carolina, like Desmond, and the guys that transferred here? Yeah, those dudes stand out. I mean, they came in right away knowing the offense. Um, so they had just a little bit of a, uh, you know, of a jump on the rest of us. And you could still see to, to today, I mean, those are the dudes that are, that are getting in the end zone a lot. And um, I think it's been able to, to be good for all I mean, the rest of the offense. They're showing everybody the way. Um, I mean, there's a whole lot of just little intricacies to this offense. And um, you know, those guys who have been in it are able to, to make those explosive plays and show us how it's supposed to be done. I don't even. I like black out out there half the time. It's it's really fast. That's all I know. Yeah. Who else on the offense are you surprised by just in terms of the talent or anything else you've seen so far? No, I mean I think our offense in general. I mean, you know, we're we're still getting things cleaned up, but that's normal, right? I mean, it's fall camp, so I think that's the time to clean things up. Um, but it is just a little bit less than four weeks till game day, so I mean, we're we're uh, honing on honing in on things. And we're getting things cleaned up pretty quickly. And you can start to see our offense. Um, and we're starting to hit it full speed. Uh, so I would say just our offense in general and how, how we've really just um, grown just tremendously this off season. And the jump from spring ball to now is just night and day difference. So we're ready to go. What's it been like working with Gavin? It's been great. I mean, Gavin's, Gavin's now you know, one of my buddies. So it's, it's always fun when you get to work with you know, a buddy rather than just a coworker. So. I've been able to learn from him. I think hopefully I've been able to 
um, or I've been able to help him as well. Um, so, I mean, just the whole tight end room, we're, we're bouncing ideas off each other. We're being able to play with each other. And I think we all bring different skill sets to the table. So I think that's something that uh, has been cool for all of us to be able to learn from one another.